I'm still waiting to get back my 16-inch MacBook Pro from repair and working on my old desktop which will be changed as soon as I will have my MacBook Pro back. So that's a nice chance to record a video to show what I'm using for work as freelance iOS developer. This setup is quite minimalistic and budget friendly but in the same time powerful enough to work on any iOS development project. Mac Mini is heart and brain of my setup. If you are a developer and spend most of the time at your desk and do not need mobility, Mac Mini will give you the best performance per euro or whatever currency you will apply. If we will take a look at Geekbench test results, i7 Mac Mini is very close to the top in single core tests and next to the top MacBook Pro models with i9 processors in multi-core tests. I have i5 uh, base model with 6 cores and 8 GB of RAM and that is not so far away in the chart from my MacBook Pro 16 inch with i7 processor. If you will start to configure your Mac Mini with more RAM, SSD and faster processor, the price will grow rapidly fast, but most likely you will be fine with that i5 model. RAM can be upgraded on your own, so you can save a bit of money there, and external hard drive will be fast and cheap storage for media files if you need that. I didn't test my 16-inch MacBook Pro and Mac Mini side by side in real life use cases, but difference in uh, Geekbench tests is not so big, and using those in real work tasks, I do not see big difference in CPU performance. If you are interested to see side by side compiling tests, please let me know. I can do that when we'll get my 16 inch MacBook Pro back from repairs. <laughs> if Mac Mini is so good, where is the catch? <laughs> For developers, I do not see any weak points. If you are like me and like to edit some photos and videos as well, you will see that video card is Mac Mini weak point and you would like to have external video card. I'm solving this problem using an external video card. I have Radeon RX 560. 4 GB video card, which is fast enough to run some games and edit 4K video. I have a separate video about this external video card setup if you are interested to see more details about it. Mac Mini can handle two 4K monitors or one 5K monitor using his own video card. With external video card data chat you have way more options. I'm using 24 inch 4K LG monitor with unpronounceable model name. <laughs> monitor stand is not adjustable and I am using stand to raise the monitor, uh, but I really like this stand because I am able to hide my Mac mini external drives and all this good stuff. Monitor stand is from local IKEA, it was around 20 euros and I see that it is very good value for that price. Currently I'm back on Microsoft Sculp keyboard. If you are looking for a wireless ergonomic keyboard, this is a good one. Also I have Logitech Craft keyboard and I like multiple device support in this keyboard. I use it with iPad and iPhone as well, but I do not like its size. It feels too wide on the table and I have to move my mouse so far away to the right. For mouse I am going with Logitech MX Master S2. There is nothing much to talk about it. This is nice and comfortable mouse with plenty of features. My favorite is side scrolling well on this mouse and multi device support. For lighting on the desk I'm using multipurpose lamp. It's not only light source but also a wireless charger for my AirPods Pro and iPhone. I found it in local IKEA, like the design and functionality on this lamp. On the back side of the desk I have no name light stripe which helps to make the work environment more fun <laughs> in dark winter days. I'm using an electric standing desk and like to switch between standing and sitting positions during the workday. Desk legs are from IKEA, they are not pricey, the price tag was around 250 euros. I have a rosy gaming chair for about two and a half years and it already starting to show age and most likely I will have to change it soon. Mac Mini have built-in speaker as well, but sound from that is very poor, you would not like to use it. Therefore, I am usually using headphones and external microphone. 